Good morning, people. Good morning, everyone. It is Monday morning, and I am uh, still not home. I'm outside. I love it. It's great. Crispy air. Hope everybody's doing great this morning. Off to a good start. I'm back again for another secret about postpartum doula-ing that will support you in that journey and in your life's journey. And that would be to lead by example. I'm going to stand up because I'm squatting and I'm already getting tired. So what do I mean by that, particularly in the postpartum doula journey? So you are there encouraging and guiding your new moms and families with the rest and the nutrition, setting boundaries, all the things that I've been talking about. So you get to be living that and embodying the things that you are promoting or suggesting. So it's not just by word, but by action. So if you're encouraging that new mom and family to be, you know, eating well and, and you know, taking good care and getting enough sleep, you get to do the same thing. So not just talking about it, but being about it, <laughs> walking the walk. And that's what I mean by being an example. So if you're working for a family and you've got your own family um, working into the space of being there for the other family and your own, and which one comes first? We, we're encouraging our moms to you know, be with their newborns, to really be with their babies and get to know them. And so you want to be doing the same thing with your own family. So... I'm encouraging you to just take a look and uh, know where you're at with your life in stepping into doulaing. And if you're already doulaing, perhaps you've encountered some of these challenges with self-care um, and making suggestions to, to families about whatever's going on with them. Another example would be, say there's a toddler and you notice that Perhaps there's some loose discipline or something that you would consider um, maybe needing an adjustment according to your perspective. Um, so, you know, how do you approach that? And I always say just, you know, lead by example. So model the behavior. You know, maybe a mom doesn't, isn't aware of redirecting, say, a toddler when they're melting down. You know, that's, that's one example. So, so you can just kind of be there and um, embody that and sometimes that works better than than the conversation or it's a reinforcement of of a conversation perhaps so i invite you to be an example and um yeah hey i just realized like i never said hi this is betsy schwartz with birth in the know and if you're watching me now, you may already know me, or maybe you don't. So <laughs> I forgot that in the beginning. <laughs> so I'm just going to throw that out there. We're talking about being an example as a doula for what you are encouraging and suggesting for recovery after birth for your new moms and families and adjustment. So one more example I'll throw out there is, say, about bonding and attachment. We're encouraging our moms to connect with their newborns. And one way that that can happen is using a sling of some kind, a carrier of some kind, one that's appropriate for a newborn. And I like to suggest to postpartum doulas to have one or two that they have available that they can clean between jobs and show a new mom if she's interested. And then use it. You know, mom says, hey, you know, can you, can you keep an eye on the baby? I'm just, I'm gonna take a shower, whatever. Um, that might come up. So you would have a sling available and then she, she might say, hey, like, what's that? I never thought of that. Or yeah, show me how to use that. So there's another example of being an example and living and walking the talk all right so that's my tidbit for today one of my secrets to postpartum doulaing this is betsy schwartz with birth in the know and i encourage you to hop on over to my website and if you want to know more you can get a free download 
the uh, 10 secrets to postpartum doula -ing and the PDF that goes with it. And if you want to reach out to me for anything else, I'm available email, Betsy at birthinthenow.com. And on Facebook, you can always message me. I appreciate you watching and uh, you all have a beautiful, awesome day and a great start to this crispy weather we're having in Florida. I'm actually in South Florida and it's quite nice. So wherever you are, just enjoy, have fun and seek some clarity. Yes. Okay. Bye. Till next time.